Model ES in 1989 became one of the pioneers of the newly appeared premium brand, luxury and quality square. With this motto, the Japanese once set out to conquer the market, and they succeeded to the fullest. Let's see if there is something to reproach the sixth generation of ES sedans with the factory name 1550 and 1560. For many, front-wheel drive is a reason not to even consider purchasing a premium business sedan. Those who are smarter, discarding snobbery, at one time made a choice in favor of the Lexus ES, not caring about the popular belief that it is a Camry clone. Life has shown that the clone is very conditional. ES is traditionally based on the platform and powertrains of the model popular in many countries, but significantly surpasses it not only in terms of equipment and finishes. Dynamics, handling, ride, noise isolation, all these consumer characteristics allow the ES to stand out against the background of the Camry. And those who understand what is at stake, instead of buying a new Toyota, are advised to take a closer look at a use 1550. This index was assigned to the car of the current, sixth, generation in 2012. In Russia, ES was offered with two engines, a 2.5 liter, for 184 horsepower, for the ES250 version and a 3.5 liter V6 with 249 horses, for the ES350. After restyling in 2015, car index changed to 1560. They were joined by the ES200 with an atmospheric 2 liter 150 horsepower, for all motors work with the six-speed automatic. And if in the case of the same Camry, we would not recommend the V6 because of its vague brakes, uninformative steering and soft suspension, then with the ES it is a completely different matter. There are brakes, suspension, and steering to the envy of many with the clear feedback flow. And that means a powerful motor will come in handy. All three engines have earned only warm reviews. The resource is enviable, up to half a million kilometers without major repairs with timely maintenance. However, when choosing a car with a fair mileage, you should not rely on your own hearing, it is better to contact specialists. Keep in mind, the services do not deal with the overhaul of these motors. Change in the collection, but the timing chain drive does not attract attention to itself at least up to 200,000 kilometers. All this, of course, again with timely maintenance. The 2-liter unit is in a certain sense efficient, economical, but will not amaze with dynamics. It turns out that version 2.4 is just right. The only thing is that it is prone to thermal shock. So the temperature and coolant level must be monitored relentlessly. And if in the case of the same Camry, we would not recommend the V6 because of its vague brakes, uninformative steering and soft suspension, then with the ES it is a completely different matter. There are brakes, suspension, and steering to the envy of many with the clear feedback flow. And that means a powerful motor will come in handy. All three engines have earned only warm reviews. The resource is enviable, up to half a million kilometers without major repairs with timely maintenance. However, when choosing a car with a fair mileage, you should not rely on your own hearing. It is better to contact specialists. Keep in mind, the services do not deal with the overhaul of these motors. Change in the collection, but the timing chain drive does not attract attention to itself at least up to 200,000 kilometers. All this, of course, again with timely maintenance. The 2-liter unit is in a certain sense efficient, economical, but will not amaze with dynamics. It turns out that version 2.4 is just right. The only thing is that it is prone to thermal shock. So the temperature and coolant level must be monitored relentlessly. It does not differ in criminal inclinations and automatic. With less powerful motors, he copes with the bang. Drivers racers should expect problems, owners of the ES350 version. Friction clutches do not like races, which, moreover, lead to overheating of the oil. Well, overhauling the box usually means replacing the torque converter, which in a financial sense will probably result in an amount of 120,000 rubles. It doesn't make sense to talk about body problems yet. In the five years that have elapsed since the start of production of the model, they have not been identified. In search of corrosion, it is worth taking a closer look only at the points of contact between the paintwork and chrome elements. But even there, except for the tarnished chrome, most likely, no crime will be found. The situation is similar in the salon. The leather of the seat trim is slowly losing its external gloss, like other finishing materials. Salon assembled very soundly and eventually looks at the level. And possible creaks are more likely to remind you of the noble origin of the car than to hint at a poor quality assembly. The suspension design is not much different from the Camry, hence its good performance in terms of reliability. 
She swallows a trifle completely, but on serious irregularity she begins to strongly resist road marriage, and her work becomes audible even in the cabin. Replacements for small things are possible after 60 to 70,000 kilometers. As usual, these are bushings and stabilizer struts. But even taking into account the brand, they are not so expensive. The most expensive components, including shock absorbers, usually live up to 150 to 200,000 kilometers. There are, however, nuances that you should pay attention to when diagnosing. For example, replacing the lower arm in front can entail very significant costs, up to 30,000 rubles. And if you follow the wise advice to use only original components, you may not like the financial result of even the most serious repairs from official dealers. It's still a Lexus. Although it is worth recognizing that many parts of the car are still unified with the Camry. In a word, we do not undertake to advise you on any particular version of the Lexus ES. Today, there is not much point in buying 2-liter cars, they are still in price, while noticeably more dynamic pre-styling versions look much more attractive financially. And as you can see, they have no particular problems with reliability. Suspension. The suspension is secure. If she is scolded, it is only because she is slightly dubbed in frosts and extraneous sounds appear during operation. It happens that a thaw does not get rid of sounds, but this is rare. As for the timing of the replacement of consumables, they are more than acceptable. For example, silent blocks and stabilizer struts are changed for the first time on a run of 60 to 70,000 kilometers. Transmission. The average resource of an automatic transmission is about 150,000 kilometers. But this is on average. In fact, the box goes longer. To prolong its life, experts recommend changing the oil with the filter more often, at least once every 50,000 kilometers. Moreover, it is advised to fill in only the original, recommended by the manufacturer. Engine. On the 3.5 engine, a crackling noise may be heard at startup. The sound is caused by a feature of VVT clutches, a common thing for GR motors. However, this does not affect the resource. Extraneous sounds can be removed by replacing the VVT clutch. Well, low idle speeds are eliminated by cleaning the throttle. The procedure will not be superfluous once every 50,000 kilometers. Body. While the main problem is chrome parts, under the influence of reagents, they become cloudy and begin to bloom. Another trouble can be considered the low edge of the front bumper with the high location of parking sensors that do not always see the curb. Therefore, you need to park carefully. Electrician. Despite the abundance of electronics, the car's electrical systems do not cause problems. On early 3.5 engines, ignition coils flied. But later the problem was fixed. As a result of fogging, depressurization of halogen lamps is possible, which can eventually lead to the ignition of lamps or electrical wiring contacts.